you've shone a light on the hidden gems that you might have missed or you don't know about, shows that we really think you should uh, bring to the front of your watch list. Um, the one I am picking this week, my hidden gem, is Utopia, which is a Channel 4 show that aired for two series, um, 2013 to 2014, before receiving a very, very undeserved cancellation. Now, this is created by Dennis Kelly. He did The Third Day with Jude Law, which was on um, Sky last year. And he did Together, the lockdown film, one-off film starring... James McAvoy and Sharon Horgan. Uh, but Utopia for me would always be my favourite. It's developed a cult following um, in the years since. Um, and it's about basically a, co a community of comic book fans who obsess over a, um, a graphic novel which is called The Utopia Experiments, which predicted a load of um, disastrous epidemics. Basically, in the world of this, it probably would have predicted coronavirus um, because in, in the show, I think one of the things is mad cow disease. These comic book nerds, they've always heard rumblings of a rumoured unpublished manuscript which predicts future disasters that are going to occur and then they find the manuscript but what this uncovers is a huge conspiracy where they're hunted down um, as you can imagine by some very shady corporations who want to get their hands on it and this show doesn't hold back it's British TV it is pulpy best and I think you're you know you're probably going to be deterred if you haven't seen it or you haven't heard of it thinking oh but it's uncompleted but the fact is, it exposed to flaws in completing a TV show. There are a lot of shows that you kind of wish hadn't been given their conclusion because it ruined what came before. But what we have here is two solid series of uh, six episode series of just really adult, violent, visceral, brilliantly acted television. The cast, Alexandra Roach, Adil Lactar, Fiona O'Shaughnessy. It's really, uh, they're basically like graphic novel characters come to life. Utopia is, for me, is a British classic that more and more people are gonna find. If I can help people find that, then that makes me happy.